Hey guys, today I want to talk about playing paranoid. Dell used to always encourage us to play as improvisers a little bit paranoid. That means we're reading something into what my partner says. If I walk into a room and talk to a paranoid person and I just say hi, they're going to be like, what, what is that? What do you mean by that? What does that mean? Right? And that's how we should be as improvisers. Whatever my partner's saying, I'm going to be reading meaning into it. As I'm listening to them talk, I'm thinking, what does that mean? What does that mean? What does that mean? That I'm answering that question and acting as though that answer is true. The improv universe is not a innocent or random universe. Things aren't happening innocently or randomly. Everything means something just like it does to paranoid people, right? And Sharon Halpern says this in another way. Assume that your partner is always making game moves. Assume that what they're telling you is a little bit more than what it seems like, right? That, what, that there's something going on beneath the surface. This technique is great because even if your partner doesn't mean that, you are still infusing those innocent or random lines with meaning and with energy. And it really energizes you, it energizes the scene, it energizes what happening, what's happening between the two of you, and that's great for everybody. All right, I'll see you next week. Hey, thanks for checking out the video. Please leave me a comment down below and tell me what you would like to hear an improv tip about. And also, please subscribe and follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. All the links are in the description down below. Thanks.